What's up, y'all? This is Boxing Mind TV on with another one. Y'all read the title, so let's get to it. So, I was on worldboxingnews.net again. I was reading articles, and the article I was reading that um in there, Andrew Garcia was talking, but he was in there, and um and he another thing, something that came out to me was that he uh said that he doesn't watch uh past fights on Danny opponents. And I found that kind of odd, you know what I'm saying? As a trainer, you should be watching your 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 opponents pass um past opponents that 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 they face cuz in other words like how will you how would you be able to um to prepare properly for for facing that opponent if you didn't watch his past fights? You know what I'm saying? Um, they saying they didn't watch any Errol Spence past fights, but then goes on to say that uh, we're not gonna fight like Mikey Garcia. We're not gonna we're not gonna run around the ring. And I'm just so I'm like, did you watch any any tape, or or are you just saying that? Cause or 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 possibly he's just saying that. Possibly he's possibly they watched the fight live and maybe going off of that, but. If he's not watching any tape, if he's really telling the truth, he's not watching any tape. Like how you, how you supposed to be Errol Spence? You know what I'm saying? As a trainer, like you not. I feel like if you if you really doing that, I'm not a trainer, but if you really doing that, I feel like you taking away from Danny Garcia's um, success. He could be more successful if you were to watch, you know, tape and letting him know, you know, to look out for this, look out for that. I, I could see that the fighters not looking at the tape. You know what I'm saying? Some fighters don't look at tape. Sometimes it's let like the trainers look at the tape and you let me know what you see and we work, we work on it in training camp. You know, and that's fine. But somebody has to watch somebody has to watch tape on the opponent to see what we're getting into. You know, what to look out for, what to work on in camp. So I, I can't totally believe that Danny Garcia is not not Danny Garcia, but Andrew Garcia is not looking at any tape. To prepare for Errol Spence, I feel like be a, that he'll be a fool for not doing that. I don't know if he's saying that just to just to get in Errol Spence's head, like we're not worrying about you, or just to, you know, it, it just you know, just saying something out to the public, because it wouldn't be smart to do that. Because it wouldn't be smart to do it, especially you you saying that you're looking for a knockout. We're gonna knock out Errol Spence. How are you supposed to do that when you're not looking at Tennessee's? that Errol Spence does like for instance if he drop his hand drop his left hand not down um when he throws a punch or when he does this or when you when you put the pressure on him what's his tendencies what does he do what what does he leave open you know questions like that could be answered by watching any tape you know what I'm saying I don't have to be a trainer to to know that you know what I'm saying so I don't understand why Andrew Garcia says that if he really is doing that if he really is not looking at tape he's doing a big disservice to Danny Garcia you know what I'm saying and prepping him up to face Errol Spence you know you need to watch tape and then need to watch tape I just I can't totally believe that he's that he's uh he's gonna be that foolish you know what I'm saying if he's not watching tape somebody in the camp somebody in his team has to be watching tape because because when you bring the sparring partners in you have to, um, you bring a man to try to mimic, you know, your opponent's style, you know, the things that he does or the things that he likes to do, you know what I'm saying? So how are you going to, how are you going to instruct your sparring partner to do certain things if you're not watching tape, you know what I'm saying? It doesn't make sense to me, you know what I'm saying? I don't think it makes sense to anybody if, if you hear a, a, a world-class trainer saying, um, they don't, they don't watch tape of their, of their, um, the opponents they facing what that don't like you you are you, are you preparing yourself to lose you know what i'm saying because you're not prepared you're not you're not prepping right you know what i'm saying you're not prepping for war you know what i'm saying you're not looking at your opponent's last mistakes you know what can we capitalize on so we get this knockout you know done a little bit earlier or we could capitalize later in the rounds he likes to do this as the fight goes on he lacks he lacks this discipline and then you capitalize on him if you're not watching tape how you gonna know you know what i'm saying just gonna learn on the fly do everything on the fly in, in the ring and i don't think i don't think it works that way all the time you know what i'm saying especially when you get at when you get at the elite 
level in boxing. You know, so I feel like Andrew Garcia either he either he's playing with us, he's joking around, or he's being real, really foolish and doing Danny Garcia a disservice. Cause you know, you put in a lot of pressure on Danny Garcia, like if if he was able to train for it, he knows what to expect. And when you tell him something in the corner, like we worked on this, you know, that's what he liked to do. So he's doing it, he's doing it again. You know, in between rounds, you can tell him like doing it again. So look for this. We worked on this. Duck, throw this punch and duck, duck this punch that he's gonna throw back and counter with this punch. You know what I'm saying? You could tell him this stuff because and it it'll be natural for him instead of him working off of instinct the whole time. You know what I'm saying? Like you'll create muscle memory in training camp by you know working on certain things that you saw in the in the tape but and then you could struck him struck him in that struck him and struck him about that within in the fight but if he doesn't have no knowledge of it how is he how is he, how is he supposed to um uh respond in the ring come fight night you know what i'm saying so it's just it just kind of like backwards that if Andy garcia is really doing this to his uh sons um career you know what i'm saying not watching any tape maybe that explains why he has all these close fights with these with these fighters that's on the elite uh, on the elite level because he's not watching any tape you know what i'm saying he's not looking for any tendencies and the other po- his opponents are looking for tendencies in in him you know what i'm saying because andy garcia says you know i don't watch any tape i'm i'll just focus on danny if he focuses on danny you will you will focus you will focus on it on his opponents too. That's helping Danny. That's focusing on Danny's uh, success rate, success like his chances that chances of him winning. You know what I'm saying? So he's not totally focusing on Danny the right way, I think, in my opinion. You know, but I mean, it's like it's it's like a recipe for for disaster to me. You know what I'm saying? By not preparing the right way. You know what I'm saying? Like you guys have to look at tape. If you don't want to look at tape. Somebody on the team has to look at tape, and and y'all has changed information from that. You know, but I don't know if Andrew Garcia is just just playing mind games or lying or whatever, just throwing something out to the to the public. But if he isn't, he's being real foolish and and he's hurting Danny in the process. You know, he's not giving him the best. Uh, possible chances to 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 win against Errol Spence by not looking at looking at any tape, you know, because I bet Errol Spence trainer is looking at tape and and dissecting Danny Garcia for this fight. So, you know, um, uh, yeah, Andrew Garcia will be will be doing Danny Garcia a disservice, you know what I'm saying? So, like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what y'all think about that Andrew Garcia not watching any tape do you believe it or do you think he just throwing it out there for the public to see and judge and talk about but he's not really he's not really doing what he what he what he's saying in, in this article um, I'm gonna drop the article in the in the in the description for y'all to look at y'all let me know what y'all think like comment describe like comment subscribe and uh, I'll be back with another one boxing on TV